Hello everyone, in this video series, we are going to talk about what is JWT or JSON Web Talk. Uh, and we are going to implement JWT or JSON Web Token in Node.js application, Node.js backend. Because why we are using JWT? Uh, JWT is used for implement protected routes. So what the heck is protected routes then? Protected routes mean in our application <coughs> there are some routes those can be accessed by anybody in the organization or anybody in the internet. Uh, some are not, some are protected. Uh, as an example, if we go to YouTube and play a video, it doesn't require any authentication. Anybody can go there and watch the videos. But if you want to put a comment on a particular video, we should first log into the Google and then we can post a comment. Uh, another example uh, in medium. Medium also we can read any article without logging to the medium. But uh, we cannot post any blog post or uh, we cannot post any comments without login, without authentication. So uh, likewise, we can use JWT for protected, uh, protect routes. Nobody can access those routes without authentication. Now we are going to see how the JWT is structured or what it looks like. Uh, here is the official website uh, jwt.io. Here it says JSON Web Tokens are open industry standard RFC 7519 method for representing claim security between two parties. JWT.io allows you to decode, verify and generate JWT. Okay, uh, now here here you can see the encoded JWT token. This JWT token consists uh, of three components. Three components. Uh, first one is in red color. So this red color uh, <coughs> is coming from this uh, header part. This header part says that the, uh, this is the algorithm uh, we are used to encode uh, and type of the uh, token type uh, type is JWT and the second part second part is payload uh, payload or the data what we are going to uh, send and receive uh, don't worry if you don't understand anything here I will explain them descriptively they mean later in our implementation part also uh, so you will get this uh, payload and what what those things um, the third one the third part consists of the signature signature uh, actually this signature part is the most important part it consists three things first one is base 64 encoded header uh, it means this one uh, this uh, header part this uh, header part encoded and the second part is payload payload means uh, this part it is also encoded by uh, base 64 then another third part is in the signature component is our secret key don't worry uh, I will explain everything step by step uh, 